When you're setting up a WordPress website, there are fundamentally just three things you need to consider, content, structure, and design. And in this 250 second quick start guide, I'm gonna show you how to set up your own WordPress website in no time at all. So this is how every single WordPress website starts live. So all I'm gonna to do to start with is create the structure by creating pages. So I'm just gonna add pages. Now my first page is called home and I'm just gonna publish it. And then I'm just gonna go off and create my other pages that I need, home, about, contact us, blog, and our services. You'll see all the pages that you've published along the top of your website in alphabetical order. So we need to change that. Come across to your site title and click on dashboard. Then come down to appearance and click on editor. Now you'll see navigation here. This is where we can fix the order of the navigation. Simply click on that. It's gonna load in your navigation. And now you can manipulate this so it's in the right order. So I'm gonna drag home to the top. When you try and drag it, it's gonna tell you you're gonna editing the menu. So accept that. Now you can actually move it up and down. You can also remove menu items that you don't want, clicking on those three little dots there. So just do that and get everything in the right order. And then come down to the bottom, click on review one change, and then just save your menu and it'll be in the right order. So now when you visit your website, the menu order will be in the order that you just designed. However, the blog will be showing on the front page. So we need to fix up the structure. This is the final step. Hover over your site title, click on dashboard, come down to settings, Click on this option here, reading. This is where you set the home page of your website. So choose this option here, a static page. You'll see it's currently showing your latest post. Choose a static page. And then from this drop down, you can select one of your pages to be the home page of your website, which for us is gonna be our page called home. If you want to also have a blog on your website, you have this other option, post page. And I do wanna have a blog, so I'm gonna select the page I published called blog. And that sets that page as the post page. It's gonna show all my posts on that page. Click save changes. Now visit your website, your homepage will be your homepage. It doesn't have any content in, but we're gonna fix that up in a minute. Click on your blog and that will show all your posts. I only have one post, but I'm gonna go off and publish some more in a minute. And there we go, now the structure is finished. Next up, I'm gonna add some content to my site. A really quick way to do this is add the patterns that come with your theme. This is the 2025 theme, comes with some beautiful patterns, you can see them here. So I'm just gonna add this one here and this one here and this one here. And now I have a brand new homepage in about two seconds. Let's have a look at that in the zoom out view. Click on that little icon there so we can actually see it. Looks pretty good. There's one more thing I wanna to do to this page though. Let me show you this. So if I go and view that page, you'll see I've still got this home page title on the top. Let's get rid of that. This is really easy to do in the 2025 theme. We can just swap this template out. So come across to the right, make sure you have the page tab selected. Come down to template, click on that one, and then click this option here, swap template. Click on that. And we've got this option here, page no title. If you choose that template, when we actually publish that page and go and view it, you'll see I don't have my title along the top anymore. All my other pages do because they're using a different page template. Pretty cool. So now we've got the structure right. This is the home page, and you can see my menus in the right order along the top here. If I click on blog, you'll see that's automatically bringing my posts in. I can click on those and it takes me to the full posts. And we've also got the content in there. This is the home page. The final step is to customize the design. So just hover over your site title, go back to your dashboard. Come down to appearance, click on editor, and that will take you into the design option here. And then you wanna click on styles. And here you can see all the preset styles where you can change the entire site. These are global styles. Now you've got these preset ones here. You can literally click on these and you can see how the entire design of my website is changing over on the right, which is super cool. You can just one click, you can see these different changes. These are all preset variations. It's changing the colors and the fonts. But if you like like a dark background, but you also wanna change the font, I just come down here and you can see you can also change the typography independently to your palette. So you can just change the fonts here and you can see them changing over on the right. Once you're happy, just click the blue save changes button and down at the bottom, click on view site. And there we go. There's my brand new website where the global styles have changed. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Click on my blog. There's my blog page. Now more in keeping with my blog site. And there we go. There's WordPress website set up in under 250 seconds. Now, obviously you'll want to go and tweak the design a little bit and add your own content and change things a bit, but hopefully you can see how quickly you can set up a WordPress website now. It's really, really quick. So I hope you found that useful. If you did, if you could hit the like button down below now, it'd be fantastic because it really does help spread the word and more people can see how easy it is to use WordPress these days. Thanks again for watching. Keep well, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.